What is up guys, this is J.A. Monster Energy here, bringing you a video after a long, long, long time. But sorry for not making videos that often anymore, I've been really busy doing other stuff. And now today, I'm, this video is only for education, educational purposes. So uh, I'm going to show you how to sync cracked applications into your, um, your non-jailbroken iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad. So now this you will need a couple stuff um, which will cost you pretty much I bet more than jailbreaking but either you register your account with I mean your iPod touch or iPhone or iPad with iModZone and get like a UDID registration and a team provision and file and certificate and whatnot and you could do this or you could buy you could go the long run and get the Apple account the Apple developer account for a hundred dollars and then you will um, be able to do this as well so now first of all you guys are gonna see here I'm gonna install cars 2 and just to show you that I don't have it on my iPod touch I mean on my iPhone you're gonna see here we get the iPhone and we're gonna go here and type in cars and then you're not going to see anything but net car show and just to prove I'm going to erase the space and nothing alright so just if you're still not um, convinced with this I'm going to open up my iTunes library and show you that I don't have it on my apps um, tab either so now we're going to open up here we're going to open up tabs and we're just gonna search cars and that's the only thing I have with the name cars I don't have any cars um, stuff so we're gonna go ahead and see here I already downloaded it it says right here cars 2 by Aver1 Kenobi whatever alright so I'm gonna browse from it and put it on my desktop now, when um, you, you, if you either have your own developer account or you have it with iModZone, you're going to still need to download this uh, application called iResign from iModZone, imzdl.com. So now I'm going to have a link below to this uh, application so you guys can check it out for yourself. So now I have it on my dock right here I resign and this is just pretty much a simple two steps three at most alright so the first time you're gonna have to put your um, developer account so you're gonna have to put the the code they give you so you guys can see there and that's mine and you're gonna have to have the provisioning team provisioning file or whatever on your iPhone iPod touch or iPad so now we're gonna go ahead and hit browse I'm going to go to desktop and then we're just going to look for the application which I already passed cars 2 all right it's going to say right here and then we're just simply going to click resign it's going to extract the original app it's going to code sign it as like it's going to make it think you have you're testing it out like you make you made the application in xcode and it's going to let you run it on your iPhone iPod touch or iPad Alright, so then we're just going to wait a second and it's going to appear right here. And just to see if that it's correctly done, it's going to be Cars 2, Aver 1 Kenobi resigned. Alright, and just to prove it again that it works, I'm going to delete it and I'm going to rename it to just Cars 2. Okay, and then just going to reopen iResign, browse. Cars 2, resign, extracting, code signing, verifying, saving, and done. Alright, so then we could just simply close it. And there we go, it appeared in the old place. Now we could delete the old one. Delete. And we're going to see that it says resigned again. So we're just going to double click. Open it with iTunes. It's going to open iTunes. And you're going to see the new cars application and now we're just simply going to connect our iPhone or iDevice gotta love that noise 
And now I'm going to switch, I'm going to add my other camera on here. Whoa, what I have personal hotspot. All right, so let me turn personal hotspot off while it shows up on my computer. And just turn it off. While I'm there, just turn off the brightness a bit. And just to prove you guys that I'm not jailbroken, I'm going to show you that I am on iOS 5. You guys can see that I have iCloud right there. And you still don't believe me, I have the notifications right there. If you still don't believe me, then we got here version 5.0, beta 2, you guys can see there that it's the second one. And if you still don't believe me, there's newsstands, and we're just going to check for Cydia. Cydia, and then there's nothing there. So it's pretty much a clean iPhone right now. There's nothing there, and we're just going to hold the camera right here. Alright, I'm going to switch to the second page, so you guys can see there, I have those apps right now. And now on the computer, I'm going to go to my iPhone, Applications, and just look for Cars 2. Sort by name, scroll down to the C's, and then Cars 2 right here. And then we're just going to hit apply. Now we're going to see here on the iPhone, it's going to show up in a couple of seconds. You can see over here we have the syncing um, little logo. And then on the computer it's saying uh, waiting for changes to reconcile, whatever. This error shows up on my iPhone, don't know why, shouldn't show up on yours. But here we go, we see on the iPhone right here, we got cars, it's loading. It's loading and it will install in a couple of seconds. So now let's just wait patiently. On the computer it says installing Cars 2. And after loading it's going to say installing. You wait a couple more seconds. And voila. It's finished installing and you're pretty much ready to go. Just to show you that it works, I'm going to click on the app. Run it. Disney Mobile. Cars 2, play, okay, you can play as Mater, Lightning McQueen, Holly Shiftwell, and Finn McMizzle, whatever. So I'm just going to pick, let's go with McQueen, let's go with ring and first one so just to prove you guys that the level will load it and everything pretty much that's it so you just tap there's the tealer the whole game and now I've lost but yeah, pretty much it. You guys can see there that I officially got the app on my iPhone without even buying it. Now, that was pretty much it. Remember, this is again for only, um, what's it called? Educational purposes. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button above for more video, interesting videos like this one, where you will be shown how to install cracked apps, how to jailbreak, and what's up with the tech world etc etc so this is jay monster energy guys again i would appreciate if you hit the subscribe button and i'll see you in a future video later